and right. So they just, we've been practicing it all week, who to block. They just got their assignments right and gave me big holes. Did you, you guys pretty much went you know, straight at it, you know, in between the tackles a lot. Did you think that was a, a, a matchup advantage for you and you guys could run the ball there effectively, and why? Because we felt that, like, they lost a lot of their D linemen. So we felt that our linemen would be able to push them off the ball. So we felt to run in between the tackles. Did you think the way you guys came out in the second half, drove the ball right down the field, um, scored to go up uh, three scores, did you think it was pretty much uh, that you had it well under control at that point? Yeah, I think we had it very well under control. I give it to the offense. They did a nice job of that. Uh, you know, like you just described it, Mike did Mike did a great job. He was running, he was hitting the holes well, he was running downfield, you know. They, they called my number a few times and I just did my did what I could and got the ball in there. But, talk about the uh, talk about the interception. Uh, Uzi came off the uh, side of the edge and he, he had a great hit on the quarterback. I happened to be in the right place at the right time and the ball came in my hands and I just ran it in. Uh, passing team, a one-back team most mm -hmm. of the year. Last week against State College, we, the second half we wanted to get our offensive line because uh, used to coming off the ball. So we went kind of more conservative and ran the eye, the old-fashioned McDevitt offense. And, you know, when we looked at the film, we liked our matchup. Uh, we thought our offensive line could do a good job against their defensive front. And the, the nice thing it gave us, and we just rolled our receivers, the three of them, you know, rotated them because what it gave us is when we were in the pro eye, they had to be an eight-man front. We either got man-to-man -man or or cover three outside, which means your outside guys are going to be one-on-one. Uh, -on -one. And we like our matchup when we've got our guys one-on-one. -on -one.